you post a partial receipt if you receive a quantity which is smaller than the ordered quantity, but you expect a second delivery which covers the remaining quantity. An under delivery, unlike a partial receipt, is also receiving less than the ordered quantity, but in this case you do not expect to receive the remaining quantity later. Over delivery, on the other side, is if you receive more than the expected quantity. Both over and under delivery happen in industries like building industry, where you order a full truck, and the full truck sometimes is 10,000 kg and other times it's 10,200 kg. The quantity of the item is kilogram, but still you can only receive a full truck. Let's see how the settings work in Microsoft Dynamics. First, you must allow over and under delivery if this should be allowed. For this purpose, you access the procurement and sourcing parameters. And on the tab delivery in the parameters, you can find the settings whether you accept over delivery and under delivery. For the percentage, for which you allow over and under delivery is specified in the released product. If I access the released products and there I want to check the item which I'm going to order and to receive, I can see on the tab purchase we got the over delivery percentage and the under delivery percentage. I want to change this to 10% up and 10% down. So if I order 10, I can receive from 9 to 11 units. The same settings which you have got for purchasing are also available for sales, and the parameters are in the accounts receivable parameters. So that's the setting for over and under delivery in purchasing, and I want to enter purchase order now. I access the purchase orders, create a new purchase order from my usual vendor. I want to enter the warehouse to pre-populate it and click the button OK. In the line I enter the item T001 and enter quantity of let's say 20. If I check the line details on the delivery tab, I can see an over delivery of 10% and an under delivery of 10% is allowed. The default for these fields comes from the item record, from the released product. I confirm the purchase order and I post the product received. Let's say I receive with the packing slip 201 of this vendor. I got to refer to the ordered quantity because now I haven't uh, registered an inventory registration. And here I can override the quantity, which is by default the ordered quantity, with this setting to 10. and click OK. When I post a partial receipt, which I have posted now, because I still expect the remaining quantity to be received later, if I post this partial receipt, I can see in the inventory transactions that we got two lines, one in the status received now and one with the remaining quantity in the ordered status. If I check the line quantity, then I can see the ordered quantity has been 20, still expected to be received, the delivery remainder is 10, and 10 have been received. Now I want to post an under delivery. Let's say I receive the second delivery now from the vendor and want to post it. This second 
received is with a quantity of five units. This is the packing slip number 202. And I tell the quantity is five units. And I select this checkbox close for received. This means that I do not expect any further receipts since the total order quantity was 20 and I now in total receive 15, five would be under delivery. I click OK and I will get an error message telling if I check the message details that the under delivery is 25%, 15 instead of 20, allowed is only 10%. Uh, I'm in the warehouse, I'm checking, and I can see, oh, I have counted wrong. The actual quantity which I receive is 9. I post the product received another time, and this time hopefully successfully. And I tell that I receive a quantity of 9 units, which is within the allowed range for the over and under delivery in order to tell that this is under delivery i've got to select this checkbox close for receipt if it's over delivery then you don't have to mark anything special it's simply by the fact that you have a total quantity which is higher than the ordered quantity it's clear that it's over delivery but with this close for receipt checkbox you tell that this is not a partial delivery and the delivery remainder has got to be zero. I click OK. The status of the order now switches to received. And if I check the line quantity, I can see the ordered quantity is 20, but the remaining ordered quantity is zero. I have only received 19 units but I do not expect any further delivery. This is under delivery.